Sing that shit. <laughs>
seasons playing in Philly during his NBA career. But in his short time as the GM, Elton Brand has been extremely productive. This season alone, he turned the 76ers team into a real title contender in the Eastern Conference, basically ending the rebuilding phase. So check this out. This is the Sixers starting lineup last season and this is it currently right now. Clearly a major upgrade. In his short time as the GM, Elton Brand has transformed this team and not even having a year under his belt, he was able to trade Jared Bayless, Robert Covington and Dario Sark in a 2022 second round pick in exchange for Jimmy Butler. And it doesn't even end there, he was also able to obtain Tobias Harris, the proven young star in the league today and Boban Marjanovic. Although it did come at a price having to give up rookie guard Landry Shamit and Philadelphia's own 2020 protected first round pick and an unprotected 2021 first round pick via the Miami Heat, essentially putting their future at a bit of a risk. But it's clear that the Sixers are in a win now mode. In a quote, Elton Brad said this, Joel Embiid seeing his growth, Ben Simmons seeing his growth. They've rapidly improved over the past season. The window is now, our opportunity is now. So once I see that window, we discuss taking a shot at it now because who knows how long this window is going to be open. So with that being said, they also had to trade Marco Fultz because once again, we are uncertain of what's to become of Marco Fultz. Once again, he simply just looks like a bust. So in order to try to regain some depth, they traded Marco Fultz for Jonathan Simmons and they were also able to acquire James Ennis. The Sixers currently have arguably the best starting five in the Eastern Conference. So after all the losing during the Sam Hinkie era and all the drama during the Brian Colangelo era, Elton Brand seemed to have completely completed the process. Once again, it's pretty impressive that he was able to pull off two blockbuster trades during the season. And if he's able to retain both Tobias Harris and Jimmy Butler during the offseason, Philly will become a threat for years to come and Elton Brand would become one of the better GMs in the league today. But with that being said, that's all I got for you guys today. And if you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like, share, and subscribe for more NBA content. And while you're at it, if you haven't, go ahead and follow me on all my social medias. Links to my Twitter and Instagram will be in the comment section below and in the description box below. But with that being said, I hope you guys have an amazing day and I'll see you all later. Peace.